Hi, this is Mandy with Scott Leroy Marketing. I want to show you how to create and post a social post campaign through your command onto your social platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and or X. Let's go ahead and click on sign in to command. And you will want to make sure that your social platforms are linked to your command account successfully. In order to check those, come right here to your name at the top right and choose settings. As you can see, we're looking for the social post scheduling link that we can see right here. So our Facebook account is successfully connected to command and we can see that here. If you are interested in also posting to Instagram or Twitter, also known as X, through your command platform, you will want to make sure that these are in connected status as well. If you have any questions at all how to do that, we do have a tip video on our YouTube channel that shows how not only how to create those accounts, but also how to get them linked to your command account as well. So definitely check those out if you want to get these in connected status. Ours is already connected to our command and we're going to post to, to Facebook today, so we should be good to go. So next step is actually creating the social post. You actually have a ton of free templates right here within your command designs tab. So let's go there to create our social piece. Click create design and click social. Click next. This will show you all the social templates that you do have available, actually other templates as well, including print pieces. On the left-hand side, you can come through and look through all of these to see what you would like to edit, customize, and use. For today, we'll stick to our lead generation topic, also underneath the home value tab. And there's some great ones in here just to come from contribution and add some value to your content, like five money-saving home improvement projects. So we're going to choose this today for our piece. We'll simply click Use. And now you can go ahead and customize this however you would like. Like for the logo, you can simply click the logo in the bottom right-hand corner. Come over to your logos on the left, My Assets. And you should see your logo for your Market Center listed here. And you can go ahead and choose to swap that out and adjust it. There's a lot of other editing you can do here within this particular editor. Like if you're looking to add listing information, you can always click on the KWLS tab right here. Let me click off of the image and click KWLS. There we go. And so you can come here to look for a particular listing and use the information that is on the MLS. So you can easily do that here as well, as well as text, stock images, your logos, other elements, and even animation options. So you can come here and customize this as much as you would like. We have a full class on how to edit these social pieces. So definitely check that out if you're looking to go a little bit deeper. For today, we're good with what this is. We're going to go ahead and choose Done at the top. And once you're done editing, this should bring you back to your Designs tab. It may take it an extra second today. Let's try again. There we go. All right. And so now that you're done editing that social piece, and again, you need to make sure that it is a social design in order for it to be included in a social post campaign. Now let's go create our social post campaign. It's right here underneath our campaigns tab. Sometimes things break. Yes, they do. It looks like we're hitting a little bit of a tech issue. Let me refresh my browser. Go to Campaigns tab again. And now we can go to Social Post tab right up here at the top. And Create Campaign.
you can choose social post. And from here at the top, just make sure the social platform that you're wanting to post to is showing right here. You can also click that down arrow and choose other business pages for Facebook that you want to post to. If you have an Instagram or Twitter X account linked to your command, you will also see the option here in this drop down to select those particular platforms as well. Okay. Next is our content. You can add text here if you would like or emojis but you can also add media. So let's go ahead and add media. And you can choose to browse the files that are on your device if you have another image or maybe you created a design in a third-party platform like Canva or something like that. You can add that image right here. We will go ahead and choose designs. That is where we created our social piece. There's our piece that we selected. So we'll go ahead and click that. We're going to try it again. There we go. Now that we see this social piece right here, we're good to go. You can crop it if you would like. And now we see that it is added into our social post campaign. If you need any further compliance added to this particular post, you can choose those options here. And now you can schedule your post. You can either schedule it to post on a future day by choosing this calendar here and choosing the future day that you would like it to post. Or you can actually publish immediately by choosing this option and it would immediately start processing and posting to your social platforms. There may be a slight delay only because the social platforms may decide to approve that post or not but typically we see this post immediately to those social platforms. You also have the option to save it as a draft if you would like. For today, we're going to publish immediately and choose publish post at the top right. It will ask you to review one more time and you can click publish post. There we go. Green banner of success at the top. And now under our social post campaign tab, we now see this post actually in published status and shows us which channels or social platform pages that it actually posted to. If you have any questions at all about how to create a social post and actually send out a social post campaign, please reach out to us at support at and we'll be happy to help. Thanks for watching.